Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Symposium 14 to 9 of International Congress of Entomology, 2024. Life Table Theory and Computer Simulation for Use in Pest Management Programs. This is the first presentation of this symposium. Integrating the two sex life table, predation rate, and computer simulation in demographic research, biological control, and pest management. Populations are the basic units of ecology. A population, pest, predator, or parasitoid, is a set of n different individuals. Life tables are used in integrated studies involving the many features of a population and the interactions between populations. They consider the sex, fecundity, survival rate, stage differentiation, consumption rate, among other parameters. Life tables are the prime tool for analyzing and evaluating these characteristics in relation to the fitness of the populations. Unfortunately, life tables have been underutilized in research involving insect ecology and pest control due to the many errors inherent to female age-specific life tables. If stage differentiation in males are omitted from the analysis, it is impossible to devise an effective biological control procedure in an accurate and scientific manner. If you were to use 100 eggs to construct a life table and use the female age-specific life table, you would encounter many problems. You are forced to manipulate your data in order to omit the entire male population. In addition, you would be unable to describe the stage differentiation. You would be restricted to using only the female eggs to calculate the population parameters you would not know how to include the pre-adult mortalities in your data analysis. If you use the age stage, two sex life table, there is no data manipulation. All individuals are included in the life table analysis. Stage differentiation can be included and accurately described. Stage differentiation, metamorphosis, existed before the science of mathematics and biology. The factual two-sex life history with stage differentiation has been simplified in the past to a single survival curve, LX, and a single fecundity curve, MX, of female population. There are many problems inherent to the female life table. You would get an erroneous relationship between the net reproductive rate and the mean fecundity. If you use adult age, there would be additional errors. The effect of sex ratio is totally ignored in data analysis. The contribution of male predators is completely ignored. You cannot use female life table in sterile insect technique and male annihilation technique. It is important to know that errors do not cease to exist because they are ignored. I am going to show you several advantages of using the age stage, two-sex life table in your research. The amazing metamorphosis of insects can be exactly described and the male population is included in the analysis and simulation. An accurate description of the survival, development, and predation capacity of a predator can be achieved using the age stage, two-sex life table. You will see a correct description of the survival, LX, SXJ, and fecundity, MX, FXJ, curves with stage differentiation. You will observe the correct and solid relationship between the net reproductive rate and the mean fecundity. This relationship is valid for both two-sex and parthenogenetic populations. There are many other advantages including a proper application in the mass rearing system of biological control agents, sterile insect technique, and male annihilation technique. The effect of sex ratio can be considered. Proper application of the bootstrap technique and the multinomial theorem, and many others. Because the theory behind the age stage, Two sex life table and data analysis of life tables are quite difficult for most entomologists. 
I have designed a user-friendly computer program to save interested researchers from several months of hard work while avoiding numerous mistakes. In the two sex life table, we apply the multinomial theorem to data analysis and computer simulation. The advantages are, it is a mathematical theory, while bootstrap is only a computer simulation. It can be used to calculate the exact probability of a bootstrap life table. Detect the probability of fertile and infertile cohorts for risk analysis. We demonstrated that the multinomial theorem can precisely predict the bootstrap sample probability by using a small population. In biological control programs, we need to determine the predation rate of predators and the parasitism rate of parasitoids. In pest control programs, we need to detect the damage rate or consumption rate of the pest. Because most insect and mite species are bisexual and stage structured, it is imperative to consider the variability among stages and between sexes. Life table research is usually isolated from predation rate study. It is not an easy task to link a life table with predation rate. The only effective solution is to study the predator-prey relationship and biological control based on the age stage, two-sex life table theory. Because the theory and data analysis of predation rate based on the age stage, two-sex life table are quite difficult for most entomologists, I have designed a computer program consumed for the analysis of predation rate of predators, the parasitism rate of parasitoids, and consumption rate of pests. For a correct analysis, the same bootstraps must be used to link life table and predation rate research. In this way, we can correctly calculate the transformation rate QP. It is the ratio of the net predation rate to the net reproductive rate. It gives the number of preys needed for the production and offspring from a predator. How to compare the control efficacy of two biocontrol agents? If one kills more and the other matures faster, which species is better? For a proper comparison, we must use the finite predation rate in computer simulation. Integrating the two sex life table, predation rate, and computer simulation is crucial for demographic research, biological control, pest management, and ecosystem study. Because the simulation of population growth based on the life table theory while consider the predation of predators and economical threshold are quite difficult for most entomologists, I have designed the program timing for computer simulation based on life table data and predation rate. Ideally, research should focus on the population level to determine the overall effect of biotic and abiotic factors on the survival, development, stage differentiation, and reproduction of a population. Again, life table can be used in population ecology, biological control, plant resistance, global warming, pesticide resistance, etc. The two-sex life table generates an accurate and comprehensive description of a population's characteristics, therefore, it should be considered as the prime tool in research involving population fitness. Using two-sex, consume, timing without understanding the theory can be dangerous. Because these computer programs are free and user-friendly, and are capable of generating numerous files for preparing figures, further statistical analyses, and offers great help to publish scientific papers. And they work on both Windows and Apple computers, they have been widely adopted by entomologists. However, as happens with many statistical programs, some users have misused these programs by not understanding the life table theory on which they are based. Errors have been noted in publications based on the two-sex life table. Some errors are due to the incorrect suggestions of reviewers and editors. In order to help users around the world, 
I have prepared numerous downloadable how to files. I suggest downloading these and studying the appropriate files as much as possible. They can be downloaded from http colon slash slash one four zero dot one two two zero dot one nine seven dot one seven three slash ecology http colon slash slash one four zero dot one two zero dot one nine seven dot one seven three slash ecology slash prod zero two dot htm unfortunately the history of science has demonstrated that it is often very difficult to challenge widely entrenched but erroneous or oversimplified methods and theories. Education is vital for the advancement of ecological research. Despite the many problems associated with the female age-specific life tables, they are still widely used in many publications. Only education can enable the next generation of scientists to select and apply the appropriate theories and methods pertaining to their discipline. I would like to quote this Turkish proverb to you. Yanlis Yolda and E. Kader Gitmis Olursen Ol. Jerry Don. Yanlış yolda ne kadar gitmiş olursan ol, geri dön. No matter how far you've gone down the wrong road, it's never too late to turn back. Integrating life tables and predation rates is crucial to ecosystem research and pest management and for a sustainable future. Conducting ecosystem research is similar to composing the pastorali. To sex, consume and timing are effective tools when used in harmony to integrate life table theory and predator-prey relationship to form an ecosystem symphony. Thank you very much.